Ramonda Young, your connection strategist at the Virginia Leadership Institute Award with this powerhouse woman, Miss April Ryan, who I've, we've had the pleasure of working with you in the we past. We've worked together in the past. It's yeah. been a pleasurable experience. And we're going to do it again, yes, seriously, we will. for the uh, next book. I got the business card. Hey. We're going to work it out so you might see us together again for the next book. Absolutely, absolutely. So I would love to ask you, you're always out here in the political scene and covering things that is important to our communities and important to everybody. Why should people uh, make it to the polls this year? Why should they go out and vote? Because a lot of people are apathetic. Why? Why should they do that? You know what? Voter apathy has been a thing since I've, for a long time. Mm -hmm. But I'm going to say this. This year, out of all political years, Voter apathy should be a thing of the past. I know this president, for African Americans, this president is not on the ballot. Um, his name is not on the ballot, but he is on the ballot. He is on the ballot. For those of you who like Barack Obama, he is on the ballot with Hillary Clinton to continue her legacy. But also, we have our issues at stake. We are a community with the highest numbers of negatives in almost every category. And if you do not believe that your vote matters, you're wrong. I'm going to give you a little history here. Maryland, former Maryland Congressman Kwaisi Mfumi, who's also the head of the NAACP, who happens to be my first program director in radio, won the city council seat in Baltimore City by three votes. Wow. By three votes. If he had not won by three votes, mm -hmm. he would not be who he was today. I mean, elections matter. If you have issues with unemployment, underemployment, you need to vote. I don't care who you vote for. Too many people died. It is your right. It is your privilege. Too many people died. You need to vote. If you have issues about home ownership, that's on the, everything is on the ballot. Education, who you are as a person is on the ballot, believe it or not. Listen to the news cycle. Unfortunately, I have to deal with it every day because I report on it every day. If I did not, I, <laughs> I mean, I mean, this election cycle is really sickening to me because there's so many issues that are just plain and people don't want to see the forest for the trees. I don't care who you vote for. The issues are there. I mean, right now, what are we dealing with? Issues of policing, criminal justice. You got to vote. You have got to vote. You've got to look at the records of each candidate. You got to see what they've said over the last couple of years on the issues that concern you. You are an important part of this nation. You are an important part of your community. Not just vote for president, vote down ballot. When I say down ballot, vote for every person, every issue on the ballot. Don't just see president, oh, I'm done. No, you have to go from president to congressperson to judge to counsel, whatever. And even vote those crazy little things. Read those things like oh, about land use or, or, or recreation parts. Vote on those issues. I'm serious. My mother, God rest her soul, my mother and my father used to take me to the polls as a kid we had those polls back in the day when you used to pull the curtain shut and it go clink and then you pull these little buttons down well still I take my children because I want them every time there's an election I want them to have the I vote button or I voted button so please go to the boat to the ballot box I don't care who you vote for just vote well I would drop the mic but I want people to hear this last statement <laughs> drop the mic but thank you so much people need to hear that a lot of times they don't hear it and coming from you see Fume won by three votes for city council wow. by three votes voting matters voting matters you heard it here from the amazing April Ryan author of the presidency in black and white um, go get her books you can see her online and on television often pay attention to what she's saying she is speaking truth <laughs> go online and buy my book from mahogany books okay online from the greatest online bookstore mahogany books <laughs> thank you so much Thanks, i sis. appreciate you <laughs> take care Ramonda young from the virginia leadership institute signing off take care